Hello again everyone, this is Tim Buell for GottaBeMobile.com and I'm back today with another Mac tutorial video. Today's topic is how do I reset or change my Mac password? Fortunately, this isn't too difficult to do. However, there are a couple of crucial steps that you gotta make sure you follow just so you don't set yourself up for failure later. So say you have an account and you're not able to get in, you tried every password you know and you keep getting that frustrating shaking screen, it's simply not letting you in. Probably the easiest and quickest method is to boot to the recovery partition on your Mac. Now, most newer Macs will have this and you can boot by holding down Command and R when the computer is starting up. If you've watched any of our previous Mac tutorial videos, we've used the recovery partition to actually troubleshoot a couple of other issues. So we've seen in the past how it can be useful for fixing problems, especially using some of the utilities. The one in question for us today is Terminal. Now, terminal can be very dangerous if you don't really know what you're doing, so be careful in here and only type reset password, all one word, and hit return. In a couple moments, you should see the reset password utility pop up as well as your Macintosh HD. From there, you can choose the user that you're having an issue getting into. Resetting the password here is definitely gonna take care of the problem, but add a hint in case you have this problem in the future, hopefully you can point yourself in the right direction if you're having problems getting back into the account. Now, earlier I mentioned a couple of crucial steps we need to make sure we address, and the first of which is going to be alerted right when you hit save. It says login password reset. And basically this has to do with the keychain, which is an application that manages your passwords. When you're in Safari and it asks if you'd like to save account information to the keychain, that's the application that it's talking about. Now those are all tied to your master login or administrative password. So when the computer boots back up, first thing you wanna do is make sure indeed that the password did save and check to see if your hint is there and then go ahead and try logging in. Next, you're gonna to wanna to search for the application Keychain Access, and from there, we can create a new login keychain. Clicking Preferences will reveal a window, which will have a button that says Reset My Default Keychain. From here, they're prompting for your new login password, the one that you just created, and this will erase the old ones, however, give you a new password to ensure all of your future passwords can be saved in a place where you are able to access them. Passwords can definitely be a tricky issue, especially if we don't use them too often unless we're frequently installing software or logging in and out of accounts. Hopefully we got yours reset for you and you guys are able to move on from here. Take care.